Alright, so today we're actually going to do this area that I've been saying we were going to do. Well, yeah. We're going to do it. Yeah, actually, fall my flask around again real quick. Really does make things a little easier when you're able to sit there and do that from that kind of range. You know, jump down. Or you just set up there. No, it doesn't matter. It don't matter. Brace mimic. Yeah, I know. You're behind me there, guy. You bitch. Was getting ready to turn the damn lantern back on because stupid game turns it off whenever you do anything. Thought I was gonna charge me like I did the second time there. You know, an HP regen build with the Blasphemous Blade would be pretty strong. Like, have the HP regen talisman go on, plus a regen spell. You know, plus the Blasphemous Blade killing, you know, and regening your HP. That'd be a pretty strong build. Weapon art heals you, you know, even against bosses, you don't necessarily have to kill something. So, I mean, physics flask, having that going too with the HP regen, would be strong. That would be pretty strong. My dick round some of that when I do, if I do some PvP. If I do some PvP, I don't know. I might try to dick around with some duels and some invasions at some point. Probably when I get like the build, when I feel like it's like actually done for a point where I'm okay with it. probably be after I kind of like get to a point where I'm done with the uh, story playthrough I'm doing where I get it to the point where I'm ready to enter the DLC uh, I might you know I tried doing some invasions or whatever and might play around with setting up my build for certain ways for EVP and whatnot, and I mean, like, the way I have it right now is kind of like to maximize damage, but what I was just talking about with, like, the physics class going, the, um, talisman that regens you, 
maybe healing spell. I, I don't know if the... I think the physics flask and the, like, healing spell cancel each other out. Like, I think you can only have one going and then the other. But, like, once the physics flask runs out, you could have that spell going. So you get the regen stack from that. I think I could switch to that helmet. Um... The, like, skull helmet. I think that says that does regen over time, too. So, like, that, I think... Uh, would maybe stack. I'd have to look at that and see if it does or not. I'd have to look it up. But yeah, that helmet. Talisman. And then the physics flask and or healing spell. I could just go with the healing spell itself. And leave my physics flask set for, like, damage. That would be a pretty solid, you know, regen PvP build. Especially with the Blasphemous Blade. there's really anything down here as far as items go that I kind of really need right now I mean other than I mean there's some like smithing stone that I could get for again like DLC items if I want to use but at the same time I'll have the the bell bearings so like as long as I have money I will. I won't really have to worry about that. Unless, of course, the DLC weapons level in a different way. It's so satisfying. It's so satisfying doing that, dude. Watching waves of them get killed. I not hit him or did that just not do damage? I am just not hitting him. I don't know. I might just not do damage to him. Might be immune to the madness. You can't sit there and snipe him. It'd be kind of dumb because, like, if you have a bow, you can sit there and do that anyway. Creature from the stars with your gravity rock. Oh no, it hurts so much. There we got the map. Someone custom well. Yep, we got a customer here. Oop. Don't really have anything that. I mean, Farmer's cookbook. The farmer's cookbook. How do I get up there to kill him? Can I get there from here? I 
think so, right? I think I remember this being a case where you have to like enter from a different area to get to him. There's like a chest up there or something. Get to it later. I think that is in fact the case. Hitting me with rocks now. All right. Tiger is here. died more than enemy is you know my presence was enough for him to like just touch me and die I want to say that this way is the way to go, but I don't know. I guess we'll, we'll, we'll find out if I'm right. Fucking stupid basilisk things. No, this just leads into like a rot. That's what it does. Underground music is pretty creepy. I know we, you can't really see it yet because I don't have the map of it, but there's like an area when you get the map below, like that's where you come from, but there's like an area over there that looks like you should be able to have access to it, you know? But you don't. I wonder if it's a situation where that was like something I intended and scrapped. That was, or, you know, maybe I, I guess it could be part of the DLC. It seems likely that that's not the case with uh, everything we've seen from the DLC so far. But I mean, who knows? Maybe they expand on some of that stuff more in the DLC with the Lake of Rot, the Goddess of Rot, all that shit. I think the DLC is going to mostly deal with Mikkel and America and more lore about them and what M America actually did and what Mikkel is trying to accomplish. Um, you know, what's the deal with St. Trina? Is that supposed to be like his alter ego or something? I'm very excited for it though. Very excited. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm so tired of that guys. I don't know how long this video is going to be.
die before you get, you know, knocked on your ass. I mean, I guess I'll give you points for that, right? One of these days where I'm just like not able to stay awake no matter what I do, you know what I mean? No, I don't care about your stupid fucking message. Open the goddamn thing. Great ghost glove war. Whoa. Be cool if there was a way that you could like skip a lot of that and get down there because that's like right where the Estelle fight goes to. I mean, all right. I pretty much did the underground area. I mean, there's still a little bit more stuff to explore there, but honestly, when we go through Ronnie's quest line, kind of brings us there anyway, so. Yeah, I did all that. I kind of did everything there is to do around here at the moment and around through here. I discovered everything that I was looking to discover with Volcano Air. I did everything in there. We've, I mean, there's still some caves in there to, to explore, honestly, but I don't think there's anything that I really care about. We explored what there is to explore in Aeonia. Killed Radon. I did everything up here in the Dragon Barrel. There might be another cave or two here to do, but the only other thing to do would be the uh, the jar pot thing up there to get the Arsenal level three one, which I'm not super worried about, but I will do it eventually. Um, yeah, this cave will take us to this divine tower that we need to do as well. Um, I did the, the Kaled Divine Tower. Oh my god, I can't stop yawning. Like I said, man, it's one of those days where I'm just, I can't wake up no matter what I do. So, yeah, this might be, might be a shorter little play session here. We'll see. Blue Latins. Sure, I killed the night rider out here. I don't always make it night to find out, but I'm pretty sure I did. There's another falling star beast out here that we can do. There's still the tree sentinels, the, the two of them up there to kill. There's the cave next to the entrance that we can do real quick. There's the gargoyle in town to do. There's the other illusory Morgoth to fucking kill. Do those. Little stuff out there in the Altus Plateau to do. Gravity boss is thrown or heat seeking here, brother. Like, what are you doing?
Okay, more smoothing stones. That's taken care of. Kind of really just going around cleaning up bosses that there are to do to get souls to, to level. I mean, that kind of really is what's left. That gotten up to 56 bigger already without status boosts. And damn. I didn't realize I got my bigger up that high already. It's all fucking annoying with your stupid horse bullshit. Only get 25,000 souls from that. I feel like I thought I remember getting more, but what do I know? Thought I remember getting more, but perhaps not. Fucking perfumer guys, dude. I'm 
know why I collect all the stuff. I never use it, but you know, might as well. Who knows what they'll do with the DLC. Maybe they'll fix the crappy system or expand on it more. I got to say, I mean, that really is like the thing that kind of disappointed me the most about this was the crappy system. It just really just feels like there isn't a point to it, you know? Like, unless you're doing like a, like a straight up bow build. So you don't have to keep running out of arrows and you can keep crafting arrows of different types. Even then though, like, eventually you can get enough to the point where like, you can just keep buying. Arrows from the various merchants that sell the different types of arrows for you. So it just, I don't know. Don't seem worth it. I guess the only thing that would be is for like the perfumer, or unless you're doing like a throwing item only build of some sort, you know, you're doing like a playthrough where you're just using like jars and throwing items. That would be kind of crazy to do, honestly. That would be pretty crazy to do. You could definitely do it, but it'd just be pretty... Oh, no. Curious. Okay, so it does do damage to him. I was just missing him before. Son of a bitch, you hit me. The fuck is that over there? I don't remember that. know what cave that is. The Great Omen Killer Cleaver. Don't I already have that though? Or is this a different one? No, nope. I have three of them. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever, dude. Cool. Cool. 
good stuff. Up here and cure the gargoyle. I didn't do this last time. Listen, listen, asshole. Trying to fucking buff up here, okay? UK souls for that? I thought it'd be a little bit more than that. I mean, it's like a, 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 a little mini boss guy there, dude. You know what I mean? Like, one of the gargoyle things. Come on, brother. Affected a little bit more. Fucking shit. The last time I'm beat you this time. Get the fuck off, guy. Get out of your sleeper hall, bitch. Oh, you got the hammer. Oh, no. Roll, please. fucking build ever but like still I don't think of everything to do out here I mean I know there's there's the god skin dude to kill here I don't really think there's much of anything at either of these two places the the windmill place over here but we'll go there anyway there's the fucking thing here at the Ur tree. There's some ruins to check out here. There's the mine, obviously. This is like one of those memory puzzle things where you gotta find like these invisible imps and shit. Another set of ruins over here. I guess let's go check these out. I guess I should probably, you know, rest and recuperate first. Er. Yeah, well, three more levels and I'll have my vigor done and then we're going to be pumping up strength. And once I get strength up to 50, we'll look at getting faith up to like 50 or something. I 
I think strike like starts the hard cap at like 50 but uh, I think like the the spell casting stats like arcane and faith and int like those can go up to like 80. like those you can really like put a shit ton of points in and scale stuff with so Oh, I was like, what the fuck's making that noise? Oh, yeah. It's just the lightning hitting the, the lightning plant things. Is there a rune that takes us down anywhere here? Doesn't look like anything. Guess I should probably also do the mountain pass up and get the Altus Plateau that way and kill that other magma dragon. Oh fuck, did you just come from here, brother? What's up? Fucking lion guy coming out of nowhere thinking you're all bad and shit. Fuck. So, How's that shit feel, huh? Huh? Oh. Apparently I'll miss there though. Okay, will you please just hit him? Thank you. Oh, larval tear, interesting. Nascent butterfly over here. Well, yeah, you're both right. You are both correct. You are both correct. gone i don't know if i've gone over here and seen what this is before over here is there hey you over here what are you guys sitting here doing swing oh god brother like get up get the fuck up swing your goddamn sword how many times have to fucking hit the button dude like, he's literally just holding a torch out, man. Like, swing the fucking sword, brother. Oh, Lord, it's raining now. Those are golden ones? What the? Oh, shit. Please. I, yeah, I've never come over here. I've never seen these golden goats before. Which means I haven't done this like hero grave either. Get off the fucking horse, man. What? There's 
like, yeah, there's a hole. I have not been over here before. I've never seen these golden goats. I've never read what this sword transcription is over here for this one. Also means I've never done that church. I've never killed that. The routing of the ancient dragons. Godwin the Golden fought to the last, earning the friendship of Dread Fortisax. That's Godwin. The, the bull goats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The lightning ram thing. I knew it. I was wondering where this was. I've seen it before. I've seen people do kind of like jokey PvP things with it to troll people and just have fun, but never actually seen where you got it. Yep. Now I know. What do you want, huh? What do you want? No, I'm on. Look at that fucking goat. Is this another church? Is there another tier here that I've never gotten before in my life? Seems that way. Lightning Great Bolt. Yeah. I've never gotten that tier before. Okay. There we go. Dragon Bolt Blessing. here on the side of the mountain, huh? Is there anything further up here before I go into the hero grave? Like, this area is so pretty like this right now. Nighttime. The, the earth tree, you know, blessing falling down. Gold. Cool. Oh! Oh! Hello! Whatever, man. Okay, so you can't back up. You got to roll forward. You can't back up. Rolling backwards, you just get hit by the after. Bullshit. Okay. Okay. All right. Fine. See how it is. I see how it is. Let's see how it is, motherfucker. Mm-hmm. 
bitch. I miss it when you could like Ow. That's when you used to be able to, to like cut tails off of stuff in the game and get some some like weapons. That was cool shit. Yeah, good night. Oh, okay, never mind, you're flying. You're flying, and you're gonna hit me with fire. Or not. You can't hit shit. You can't hit shit, mobile. Fucker, I'm gonna miss you though. Oh, stop locking onto your head. Oh. Oh. What's up? Little boot to the face. Got, hmm? You hear me right here? Oh, you're doing a little fake out. What's up? What's up? Hmm? Hmm? We're talking shit before. That's an Axis Glaive. Okay. Alright. Dig it. All right, so that's where that dragon goes. Okay, I've I've never fought this dragon before up here. That's the dragon that Godfrey uh, convinced or became allies with. Interesting. All right, well, now we've got this hero memorial thing to do. Well, I've never done this before either. I'm gonna come down here and hit the save and level up. And we'll see what this is all about. Who the fuck are you sitting over here like this, mate? Oh, yeah, Black Knife Assassin chilling over here? What is this about? What is this about, huh? We both kind of messed that one up. Okay. Come on up. Come on up. There we go. All right. Oh, we get the actual black knife. The actual black knife. Dagger once belonging to one of the assassins who murdered Godwin the Golden on the night of the black knives, which were performed on the oddly misshapen blade imbued with the power of the stolen rune of death. 
That's the actual knife that killed uh, Godwin. Okay. 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 It's also one of the legendary we I want to get all the legendary weapons and spells this game too because that's the only thing I haven't done if it's possible it might be one of those stupid things where you gotta go on Andrew Plus to get everything Painted Hero's Grave Yes. All right, level up. Bam, a few more levels. Oh, and we got a little stone key here already. What do we have in here? Interesting. Crimson Sea Talisman. What does that do? Well, I have that thing on the whole time. I've done on the whole time and I've not been doing max damage. Boost HR registration for Flask of Crimson Tears. Okay. Interesting. I feel like the boss of this is gonna be one of those fucking revenant things, dude. I feel like that's oh, uh huh, uh huh. Gamer, gamer senses, gamer senses. I knew it. All right, well, before I go through that. Bitch, get the fuck out of here with that shit. Stupid ass revenant things, man. Those are those those are legitimately like the most annoying creatures. Like the ones in the Halog tree, dude. Like it's insane. They're like fucking E Honda Thousand fucking punch maneuver they do. It's crazy. Come at me, bitch. Come at me, bitch. Oh, you got stunned. You got stunned, huh? Hmm? What happened? Is that a ladder? Are you supposed to kick down the ladders? Is that what that is for that shortcut? Let me make sure. No, it's not a ladder. These banisters are just banisters. Okay, I thought. What the fuck is the point to this illusory wall then, right? Like. What is the point to this illusory wall? Okay. I don't get it. I mean, the only thing that happened is the shadow imp dropped down and became killable. What's up? What's up? Y'all gonna come up here after me? All right, come on. Come on. Step into the light. Well, you done? You done chasing me, huh? What, what's going on here? Brother? Oh, now you're chasing. Oh. What's 
What's happening? What's happening? Oh, you almost got me. You almost got me. Oh, you almost got me. Come on. Come on. Keep it up. Oh, you're almost here. You almost got me. Oh, what happened? What happened, you dumb fuck? Come on. Come on, buddy. Oh, you hit me. Oh, no. I'm, I'm so hurt. I'm so hurt. The bleed build up. Oh, goodness. Wait for another one of these revenants to show up. further down yonder seems to be nothing I don't even know why again I picked those flowers I don't use them for anything but they're there so I might as well grab them what the fuck is this am I gonna get is this like quicksand I'm gonna fall through here what is this Mindell soldier ashes, oh boy. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Should have stayed in the shadows where you belong. There, there was no consent to the hugs, okay? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Keep your hands to yourself, sir or madam. Itch. What do we have in here? This requires two of them, huh? Oh no, there's one. Dragon Crash Shield Talzin plus Uno. Okay, this is originally where we fall down from. Okay, okay, okay.
Lam. Fuck are you doing, dude? Just farting everywhere. Kill them as quick as possible if you don't have a heal spell. If you have a heal spell, you can just like straight up stun them by like casting it. This is not where I just. No, it's not. Excuse me for just one second, sir. Oh, what? You just like reappear, dude? not seeing one of the light things in order to make this man physical that I could kill him. That is a problem. That is a problem. If it's further down, I gotta run past them. Nope, there's no running past them toward anything. Got you, brother. I got you. I understand. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Oh, fuck me, dude. I'm so tired. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And there's a ladder there for me to go anywhere. He's still following me. Uh, I guess. I gotta do one of these maneuvers. You, uh, oh yeah, yeah, you're still right behind me. Okay, all right. Good sir. Right this way. Emma, come on, brother. You're so close. You're so close. You're so close. You're so close. Come on, you can do it. Hey. Where are you going? Please look at that. You hit me. That happened. That happened, brother. You can do it. Oh, look. You hit me again. You hit me again, dude. You hit me again, man. There you go, brother, man, bill, mother, fucker. Somewhere a heavy door is open. Okay.
Question is, where the fuck do I go now for that door? I remember seeing the door. Guess I sure how to get there. Ah. Woo! Almost, almost. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Hero of Zamora, huh? It's when you fucking guys. Mm hmm. Ancient Dragon Knight Kristoff. Okay, well, you know, I was hoping for something a little bit more useful. And a little bit more cool than a stupid fucking ash like that, but I guess that's my bad. I guess that's my B. You know what I'm saying? That's on me. Oh my god, dude. Fuck me. Okay, well. Human did this new stuff. Can I? Am I able to just like drop down? from here straight to this mine because that would be pretty dope too that would be pretty dope that looks like a negative that looks like a negative ghost rider the pattern is full so we're gonna have to do one of these maneuvers <laughs> we have to do one of these maneuvers Oh, yeah. Fuck. All right. Well, I think on that, I'm actually going to call it for now. I am super tired, you guys. I uh, appreciate you all watching. Hope you're enjoying the playthrough so far. Getting ready for the DLC. We uh, really don't have much left. I mean, there's a little bit of stuff to do here in the Altus Plateau. I got this little memory stone. I think it's, it's either memory stone or a spell. Uh, that to do, Earth Tree to do, there's a couple of ruins in here, I got this mine to do, God Skin up here. Basically we're kind of just on cleanup stuff as far as like up here goes. Uh, there's a mine to do in here and a divine tower, there's, there's some divine towers I need to do to light up these ruins. Um, got some new stuff that I've never seen or done before. So there's that. That's pretty cool. Um, I think we can, I think down in here is like the Dung Eaters quest, like down in here, the same spot where the Boiled Prawn guy is. So probably next time we can start looking at doing that. This leads down to this Divine Tower, so we can do this mine tomorrow and get that Divine Tower. Uh, we've already done that Earth Tree. There might be some stuff here to do in... Landell, I know there's the bolt of grand sacks to grab for the legendary weapon stuff that I want to do. And well, there might be a couple of other things, but for the most part, other than going into the sewer, there isn't really much in the actual capital itself really to do. So we'll clean up all that stuff. I'll probably then just progress this top stuff, get everything done up through here. And honestly, there's really not much more to do up here. There's a couple of caves along the way through here. There's this ice dragon in here to kill. This is Castle Soul. You can go in here and get the other half of the medallion to go to the Halig Tree. So you can come back here and go to the Halig Tree and progress some of that. But, you know, mostly up in here is kind of done. There's a hero's thing in here to do. Uh, and then kill the fire giant. I'm not going to ignite the fire yet, though, until they do all the rest of the NPC quests that I can do. So, we'll probably progress through all through that next time. 
And then after that, we're probably going underground and doing everything down through Notcron, through Ronnie's quest and getting that finished. And then once I've got all the NPC quests that I can do up until this point done, then we'll light the fire, go to Fair Missoula, finish that. Um, I want to do Millicent's quest line, like I said, so we'll progress the Halleck tree all the way up to there and get the save just before Melania. I don't want to fight Melania until I've gone through the DLC. I want to see what changes any of her interactions based on if there's anything going on with Mikula or not. So I will probably do everything else other than beat Melania. There's also Moog to do. We can go and beat Moog too. So there's all that. So still a little bit of stuff left, but for the most part, we're pretty good to go. So uh, if I wake up, I'll come back on and play a little bit more. But uh, otherwise, yeah, I'm pretty tired today. So we're just going to call it there. So again, Appreciate you hanging out. Hope you're enjoying the playthrough. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed it, give it a like, get a sub. Would help me. Greatly appreciate it. But uh, yeah, otherwise, I'll uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one, everybody.